hey, let's work together and share our ideas on the same wall so we can have more resources to teach online. Wait until the end of the video so you know how to do that. Hi, this is Teacher Oscar for Handy Learning. In this video, like I said in the beginning, we're going to learn a new tool online so we can collaborate all together as teachers to share resources, ideas, brainstorming, pictures. But it is also a tool that you can use with your students to work together at the same time in a collaborative way. So let's stay, stay until the end of the video. And of course, if you like the content, don't forget to subscribe and like the this video let us start the tool i'm talking about is called murally so in order to go to this website you gotta type mural.ly murally and it's going to lead you to the same uh, site that you are seeing here you can start your account by clicking on start now for free once you do that well you have to uh, type your information all right and if you type here an, an email that belongs to Gmail, all right, I'm going to click here on that I'm not a robot captcha, accept the terms and condition. But if you type a Gmail address, then it's going to give you the, the option to create your account with that Gmail, all right? So in this case, I'm going to go ahead and sign up with my Google account. I'm going to click on continue and uh, I'm going to have my main dashboard. Well, I need to accept terms and, continue, and conditions, continue, and here I am. All right. It might ask you for typing a, a workspace name. This is for my mural. So I'm going to type here handy, handy learning collaboration. Okay, that's going to be the name of the this wall. And I'm going to go ahead and click on Next. If you wanted to share this mural with some specific people, you can type here the email addresses. I'm going to click on Next, and it's going to ask me what type of mural do I want to create. It's uh, suitable for, it says here, plan a sprint or a project if you're working with your uh, teachers, with your colleagues. Learn more about a problem, brainstorming ideas, understand who you are designing for, brainstorm ideas with your team, design and evaluate the solution, reflect on your team's process. So this is a great tool for uh, teamworks. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and click on brainstorm ideas with your team and click next. Once I do that, I'm going to choose the kind of wall I want. I don't want a template. I'm going to create a blank mural so we can all and collaborate together all right it's going to guide you through some tutorials showing you how to do this so you can just click there it's going to show you how to do all the steps all right so here it shows it it's guiding you here it allows you to to click or to add one figure the next step is that you can look for images i'm going to look for a teacher all right so you can uh, search the web for images. I'm going to choose any picture and I add it to the mural. Something that you have to know is that this, this part of the mural that we are seeing here is just a very small, is just a very small size. So you can zoom, okay? You can zoom, you can use your mouse or you can drag and move. I'm going to use the mouse to zoom. And Take a look at this. I'm just using the first part, the first corner, and I can just make it big again. This is this looks like a real wall, all right? So you can do zooming, okay? Move it and zoom back. Then you add more uh, figures. You have you can have a layout, a design, something that's for uh, suitable for the purpose that you want to have all right so i'm going to use a uh, layout just the number the normal layout okay finally once you created your mural 
you can share the link okay you can do it in many ways you can invite people you can just copy this link and this is the one that i'm going to leave in the description of the video so you can all collaborate and work together on this okay so i just copied it i'm gonna paste it anywhere i do it's going to appear and the person who has the link can access Murali without creating an account and can collaborate with the rest of the people i'm going to click on done and it's going to be ready okay so we are ready to create our mural here so if you want to be part of this and start including things just click on the link for this collaborate collaborative uh, wall and you can start adding ideas the purpose is that you share your teaching ideas that you share that you practice so you can work with it with your students later all right so let me know in the comments what you thought about this video and if you want to know more about online resources for language teaching thank you very much see you in the next video